Right now, it's the last day of summer break for many students in the metro, and that has plenty of parents making a mad dash for those last minute essential items before the bell rings. With more on that and what's top of mind for parents at this hour, 11 Alive's Erica Murphy is reporting tonight from the Smyrna Community Center. Sunday saw some parents in Cobb Hello. County taking advantage of last minute school supply giveaways just before their kids head back to the classroom. And some of these parents say that these events are helpful in more ways than one. Jacqueline Afanador has a blended family of 10. She says this time of year is challenging for parents as well as kids. Their mentality changes. Um, they become more wanting to sleep in. She was one of many parents who came out Sunday to the Smyrna Community Center trying to find those last minute essentials for their kids just before the first day of school. Ramon Cruz was also one of the volunteers with the Merge City Church putting on the school supply giveaway. The group plans to outfit 80 kids with all that they'll need for the first semester. I would have to come and ask for donations and things of that nature to help them through their school time. So now that I'm in a different position and I have more research, uh, I'm sorry, resources, um, being able to give back has, is, is, is mandatory. The spirit of giving back was appreciated for parents as classes start back up on Tuesday for the Cobb County School District. With prices still on the high side, many parents like Chiquita Thurman are trying to find a way to save a buck or two. I would say maybe a thousand or more. So it's very expensive. It can be very expensive. And I have two children. So. No matter what the cost, a good education for these kids will be priceless. But third grader Trace Thurman does admit that he's glad to have his new AirPods to go along with his reading, writing, and arithmetic. All you got to do is just hook them up. And then when you do that, all you got to do is just make sure you don't lose them and keep them safe and stuff. And make sure nobody don't sell or anything. Reporting from Smyrna, Erica Murphy, 11 Alive News.